Hi, DF. The end of the year will be super loaded with so many things coming out. Do you know how you'll possibly get through it? Well, Tom, it's starting now, right? The next couple of months are probably going to be the most intense we've seen since the launch of the current generation of consoles, possibly oh even more so. Yeah. Uh, John, how are we going to get through it? I think it's basically going to be a case of simply just getting our heads down and doing what we can and hoping that people understand that we can't always cover their favourite game or their most e eagerly anticipated game in, in the sort of time frame that we would have in a less busy period. That's exactly right. We can only do what we can do. Right. And I think it's we have to go in the priority of, you know, the big important games get top priority and there's a bunch of them. We divide it up between us. And then there's the second tier, which is the games we really want to cover and talk about. And if there's time, we get those in. But then there's other stuff where it's like, maybe we would like to talk about it and we wouldn't in a slow period, but we just don't have the resources to cover it. And maybe that's where we can take advantage of this show, uh, where we actually bring up games that we may not have time to do a full video on and talk about it there to at least share our thoughts on it, right? So that's kind of the idea, I think. But it is, it's going to be absolutely crazy for us. And I'm going to be like, and this is, a, I'm actually a little bit excited because it's the first time this whole generation where it's going to be, I'm going to be doing so much Xbox coverage and I'm kind of excited to be covering Xbox first party games again, like Forza mm -hmm. and Starfield. Uh, it's, it's going to be very, very cool. And Forza especially is going to get a lot of love from us. We have some big things planned. Uh, including i do plan to do the follow-up to the gt sport versus forza motorsport 7 video that everybody <laughs> has enjoyed so it's going to be an interesting battle there to see how that plays out but yeah so very cool. exciting stuff uh, thoughts about the upcoming onslaught of games alex terrifying in some respects i'm terrified because the amount of stuff to do and so mm. for me, I'm also expectations management, just like our good friend, Jeff Cayley. Um, <laughs> I'm going to say, I'm going to say like, you cannot expect every PC video that I'm going to make is going to be a ratchet and clank 27 minute banger. Um, <laughs> I would love to do that for every game with infinite time on this universe and infinite patience as well too. Uh, but that is just not going to be doable in the time ahead. I imagine like John said, the bigger games are going to get bigger precedence. And sometimes I imagine well, maybe I may be a week off or so or even longer before the review comes in for me, because guess what? It takes a long time to do one of these reviews. So mm -hmm. that's yeah, what I got we're, we're trying to organize some backup. Um, yeah. And, uh, we'll, we'll hopefully muddle our way through uh, it, but it's going to be a trying time for I sure. I think there's going to be, we're going to have to give into the fact that for at least this especially applies to me, we're going to have to be okay with smaller videos. Uh, yeah, you know, sure. for, for the mm -hmm. big ones, we can still go all out, but it's going to have to be like 10, 12 minute videos uh, for some of these games if we want to get them covered. And I think that's perfectly fine. Uh, but yeah. man, looking mm -hmm. at October, we got Assassin's Creed, some of the big ones, Assassin's Creed, Forza Motorsport, the Arkham Trilogy on Switch, of course, The Lords of the what? Fallen, Alan Wake 2, uh, Marvel Spider-Man 2, Super Mario Wonder, there's, there's Sonic in there as well. It's the Metal Gear Solid Master Collection, which is just a, you know, oh, no. that's kind of interesting. Uh, yeah, that's 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 not everything, but that's a bunch of October stuff. Yeah, and do you want to know the craziest thing is that when it's all over, we're in December, right? Things start to kind of calm down a little bit, but essentially we need to do thirty days of work in twenty. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> And so it doesn't slow down at all for us, really. So no. it's, it's going to be crazy from here on out to the end of the year. And uh, yeah, exciting, but also terrifying at the same time. So welcome to our world. <laughs>